Gilbert and welcome to my guitar instructional DVD. Today we're gonna go over the songs from my all guitar instrumental album Get Out of My Yard. I'm gonna try to find the most interesting parts, the coolest riffs, the most rock and roll ingredients that I use to make this record and break them down and show them to you so you can insert them in your own playing and make your own rock and roll guitar. So let's have a good time, tune in, plug in, get ready to rock out, and get ready to get out of my yard. Thank you very much. When I was planning the Get Out of My Yard guitar solo, I knew I had to do something uh, out of the ordinary to catch people's attention and let them know that I could still play fast, terrifying, shred guitar. So um, the idea I had was to put three E strings on a guitar neck, just three strings. And the reason I did this is it makes arpeggios really easy to play. And to me, the whole secret of playing fast is to make it easy. So, uh, for example, uh, with those three E strings, I could do a real simple pull-off. Just uh, an E minor or E major triad. And then do that on each string, same frets. So suddenly you have three octaves of E major. And you can play it super fast, you know, it's just that, you know, super easy kind of pull off and uh, that becomes something something pretty terrifying with those three strings. The um, the next thing you can do of course is on the higher frets you could stretch. And these are all minor triads which is a, a fairly easy shape for the hand. And you can do all your normal hammer on pull off licks. And the nice thing is, it's all the same frets. So you don't have to shift positions, and you can just play E minor all day and make crazy licks that way. But um, I wanted to go beyond playing in one key. And the problem is, a lot of the stuff in the middle is too far for me to stretch and get those kind of arpeggios that I wanted to. So that's where I had the idea of having a human capo. So my friend Mike's gonna come in and, and be the capo for me. And for Get Out of My Yard, I began in C, which is right there, and I just did a C minor triad. 
And again, I'm using that, um, those kind of simple pull-offs. And I'm just doing one downstroke with my right hand for each string. So it's all downstrokes. You got that. Yeah. So back to the left hand. Uh, after that, I just stretched up a fret. Then the capo shifts down. I stay the same. Capo shifts down again. I go down here. And capo shifts down again. Then there's a big shift way up here. Another shift. <laughs> then we have a quicker shift with diminished. Uh, where does my fingers go? And shift. And shift one more time. And the very last shift. Then I do a pull off. This is an octave, and I actually bend the string up with my right hand, or sorry, my left hand. And then just release and hit a big E. So that is the secret of the Get Out of My Yard solo, and uh, now with your own human capo, you can do it at home. Rock and roll! <laughs>